Okay, so what is up guys? This is Karan here back with another video. Welcome back to Tech Karan YouTube channel. We've installed MSM Extended Custom Room based on Android version 10 and this one I have installed the extended version 11.5 official version. I'll provide you the link in the description for the official source where you can download for your device also. If this build is officially supported for your device then it's good and I'm gonna share with you which are the great things you get in MSM Extended Custom Room. It has a lot of customization options. It's not that much great in the terms of performance but it's great in the terms of features and customizations. So now let's get started. Okay so let's start with the home screen as always and from the wallpaper you already know about this room this is MSM extended this wallpaper is pre-installed in all other builds of MSM extended if you're using official build on your device. Swiping right you get this kind of google feed options are available which is quite great thing but if we talk about the home screen launcher I didn't got any option available here. But with the icons you can say this might be the CR Droid Room Launcher which has some customization options include icons, home screen, app drawer and miscellaneous. No other things and one of the bad things, negative things which I didn't like about this build is the swipe down gesture. It does not have a swipe down gesture which should be there but we didn't got this gesture here. You can swipe down from here this kind of quick settings panel you can customize on your device. These options are available in the settings in which you can customize your quick settings like this and there are a lot of extra styles are available too and as I already told you this is one of the most customizable rooms ever. Just remember I said this is one of the most customizable room ever. I'm not saying that this is the most customizable room ever. This there's a difference between both of these terms. We have some other things included airplane mode, CPU info, FPS info and all the main tiles which are important. Now let's move on to some other things. We have other things included. First of all let me just tell you about the widget. I'm using the search DuckDuckGo widget, we didn't got any widget here, we didn't got Google search bar here, which were expected things but we didn't got. So you can change the launcher and if like me you are also using G apps from the mini package, you might get the Google Pixel launcher installed like I have already installed. Okay let's move on to the camera first of all. I'm using MSM extended room on my Redmi Note 8 and this is the official build I have MI camera pre-installed. This is MI UI stock camera, this is not the ANX camera, MI stock camera which means we have the ultra wide options, the 48 megapixel options are available too, the portrait mode and night sight, some other things including video recording and a lot more things. And moving on to some other things, if we talk about the Gcam, I'm using Gcam 5.1, the very old package of Gcam right now. I just want to check out that if the old Gcam works fine, but yes, it's just perfectly fine. So you can use this GApps package also. This one is Gcam 5.1 by TechCurrent. So if you just want to try it out the old Gcam version, you can try it out. I'll provide you the link in the description so that you can choose the Gcam 5.1 on your device. Now let's move on to some other things. Let me tell you about the Geekpen score first of all. If we talk about the Geekbench score, we got 309 Geekbench score as a single core and 1316 is the multi-core score which you get in this MSM extended custom room. And this Geekbench is for Redmi Note 8, it's not about other devices, features are for other devices too. Let's check out other things, 309 is a single core score which is normally better than the average score and also the multi-core is also better than the average score which is quite great thing and if you talk about the best thing I'm using Magisk 20.4 and talking about one more thing we have device is certified as you can see if my device is certified I'm using Magisk 20.4 this is one of the greatest things ever about the custom room okay let's move on to settings and settings 
is same just like one UI. You can enable this option in settings, MSM extended settings, and which are these kind of things, network and internet connected devices, apps and notifications, battery, same things. But when entering a menu, we have something kind of different. If you open network and internet, you can see some new things, Wi-Fi and mobile network animated icons which is quite great thing and same like other things like in connected devices we have the bluetooth animated icon in apps and notifications we have this kind of animated icon in every menu you have animated icons if you open the xiaomi parts we have the me sound enhancer available and my maybe this option is only available for at b note 8 not sure about other builds but other things are almost same like this if you open the storage option we didn't got anything here but when you open the privacy option you have this kind of animated image available here too which is kind of great thing and this is something unique and i don't think so you get this thing in almost any other custom room till now so first of all we are going to take a look at the theme room where we get the system theme first of all which have a lot of extra themes available google dark solarized dark pitch black etc and which is the great thing we have extensions background i have applied the gradient color and as you can see it's just very good looking we have the ui radius also some status bar icon customization status bar height and these are the main things quick settings style styles there are a lot you can customize anything from here so let's take an example just choose this one and if we talk about this kind of quick settings this looks very much unique we don't get these kind of quick settings in any other custom room still now ninja have some other things as you can see like this and like this you can customize your quick settings like just great there are a lot of extra effects options are available you can see ink cookies circle outline neon light and some other things just open anything from here this is how you can customize your quick settings okay so we have a decor room option available here in which you can customize your ambient display animations we have some other battery styles options available in which you can check out the battery style in quick settings quick settings battery location status bar battery icon and custom charging symbol etc custom charging symbol includes flash state plus star rupee dollar euro or cent and these are some unique features which you get in msm extended custom room only okay so we include some power menu customizations notification navigation lock screen quick settings status bar system and extras as i already told you which have rounded corners gaming mode and there are a lot you should try out this build for sure I'm not saying it's just great in the terms of performance and all. You should try it because of the customizations in your device. This has great customizations and I don't think so. Some unique features are available in MSM Extended you get in any other custom room. Other custom rooms are available which have some great features but features which you get in MSM Extended are not available in all other custom rooms. You should try out this build for sure. This was all from today's video. I hope you like it. If you like it, don't forget to like, share and if you are new to my channel, make sure to subscribe me now. This was all. Thanks for watching. Goodbye. Have a nice day.